just dug this about two inches in the ground. Looks like I got a silver ring here. Pretty fat one too. Yeah, I'd say that's silver. Uh, I'll let you know when I get it cleaned up, but ring like a silver quarter, so I'm saying silver. So, not bad. Ain't that many signals this morning. A couple pennies, one quarter, a few dimes. But got some silver now. I'll check it when I get home and get you some good shots. Just dug this about uh, four inches in the ground. Not sure what it is. Something. But, uh, I don't know. I'll let you know when I get home and get it cleaned up. Maybe a pendant or something. Not sure. But, I'll let you know when I get home and get it cleaned up. Interesting piece. All right, get back to you at the next. And here we got the roundup. Uh, probably gonna do this in two videos because wasn't that many good finds out there today. At seven dollars and ten cents in clad, one weedy, the very rare 1944. This little uh, charm pendant, I guess. It's just bling. It says happy birthday on it. It's a book. It's a little charm book. Anyways. Got that. And the good find. 925. Rather, it's Mark Sterling. Not 925. Nice sterling ring. Probably turquoise in there. Nice little ring. See if I can get the mark for you. And yeah, down in there. I don't know if you're gonna see that. It's Mark Stir Sterling with a maker's mark. So it is silver. Nice ring. Anyways, just a, about a two hour hunt this morning. And I'm probably going to break this up into two videos because there wasn't a lot of finds. Alright, get to you in uh, the second part. So yeah. Figured I'd do a review of my uh, six months of metal detecting since I retired and just show some of the stuff. Uh, some of this stuff I found before I had a video camera to actually film it. And then some I put in display cases like here, you know, religious pendants and uh, tokens and whatnot. Here he is. Some of the religious pendants I found. The Boy Scout tie clasp. Got three different ones there. Got a car, tokens, war nickels. The bling rings. Well, yeah. this bracelet I dug last, uh, I want to say March, I dug this. It's a tungsten bracelet. More bling. This is all bling. Bling bracelets. Big uh, copper hoop earring. More bling bracelets. Bent modern coins up there. Another war nickel there. This one here is a 1940. Uh, uh, Italian coin. Thought it was gold when I dug it. 
get a Canadian dollar. An old car, I dug that in my front yard. All right. Anyways, one of my favorite finds is this uh, Masonic symbol. Dug this at a park. It was kind of weird that it was in a park, but. And, uh, you know, more religious, uh, watch fob. This is a Radio Orphan Annie decoder badge. Another one of my favorites. More religious items. More religious items. This piece here is a past vice president of the 4-H club. And a uh, little Girl Scout emblem. You know. A couple Indians. Uh, I had a Pepsi bottle here. Let me zoom in on this. Found this in the woods. A rather old Pepsi bottle. And then uh, also found this. Which is complete. Which I was kind of shocked about. It's a... Uh, very uh, old uh, container. Very nice. Was in the woods. Skeleton key. And uh, yeah, so for six months, you know, that's the majority of the stuff. Uh, the rest of it stuff is in the pictures, coins, uh, you know, miscellaneous items. But not bad for six months of hunting. Alright, thanks for watching, man. Good luck out there. It's rain.